Hi, this is Shallow, and I'm going to introduce how to import 3D animation into um, AR way. And the software I use here is Blender and Adobe Arial. And I think it also works on 3D uh, Maya, 3D Max, or Cinema 4D. And if you want to do some 2D animation, like a uh, drawing or like if it's also work um, uh, after effect or procreate, I think. So let's start with the blender. And so right now I've already have one animation. It's look like that. So it have like 80, uh, 80 frames. And uh, the engine I use here is EV engine is much quicker and well, rendering very quickly. And uh, we let's go to export menu. And so first we need to make sure our resolution is correct. And then the frame, we need to start with, we need to like have all animations. So it start like at one, two, 80. And then we need to adjust the FPS. It's based on the speed you want to have. So if I want to have a much slower animation, yeah, it will look like that. Okay, that's cool. Okay. And then we need to like, uh, to make sure the file we want to have. So we have a, like we need to export into this file and we just need to open it and accept. And then go to the file format. We need to choose PNG. Yeah, it's very important because uh, it's the only way to have a transparent background so you can play in the real world. Uh, and as a color, we need to choose, we need to, we need to choose like RGBA, which means RGB add add alpha to no. So in this way, you will have a transparent background. Okay. And that's all. Let's start rendering it. Yeah. Okay. Make sure it's okay. And render animation here. And okay. It's rendered right now. Okay, it's done. And let's go to see the file we have. So go to the file you save and to check all the all the photos are in uh, always like transparent background. Okay, so right now it has like a pretty trans pretty nice animation. Look like that. Okay. So the next step we need to do is to wrap them into zip file. We need to wrap all the step together, just need to send, uh, wrap them into a zip and then send it to your iPad. So we have, we actually, we have a, we have a, a real on our computer, but this one is in beta version. So actually it works not very good. So I strongly suggest you just uh, use iPad to work on AR and also, okay. So right now I've already sent file to my iPad and let's continue to work. So this is the main menu for the Adobe Arial and we just need to cl click create new and choose let, let it finding a service at a here and click it and touch the small plus button at here and choose import file and then click the zip file we've already done and wait a minute because it need to load the Im or image you have at here 
it's based on how many image you have so at here we have like 80 minutes so it need to a little bit time and now it's loading at here and let's and let's adjust the size and also the location hmm. okay i think okay okay i think it's good at here okay now it's almost done actually now as we just to make sure it will play the image let's see the preview first it doesn't animate so we need to add animation at here click behavior trigger start action and click play images and yeah that's all and if you want to let the and if you want to let the animation always just need to click infinite and let's see the animation here yes yes and yes okay so it's done let's see the preview okay 